What is going on everybody? It is Abach1654 here and today I'm going to bring you a video on how to unlock akimbo pistols as easy and as fast as possible in black ops 6 i'm going to show you for example the class setup that i use the pistol that i use which is the grekova it's an automatic pistol but this method will allow you to use it for any of the pistols that are in the game i'm going to show you first the class setup that i use to achieve the akimbo um to uh, achieve to unlock the akimbo i'm also going to show you uh the map that we played uh all the perks that i use and the class setup as well and this this method could also work for you even if you don't have the double XP on. Obviously, it'll take you a little bit longer, but uh, I took advantage of the double XP weekend that we have going on at the moment. They're going to be releasing that more and more as the game goes on. But let's uh, jump right into the class setup that I have. So I'm using the automatic pistol. Grekova is the this is a pistol name, I believe. That's how you pronounce it. Um, but with pistols, I always go with silencers. Um, that's or so the suppressor on it. Yeah, that'll help a lot with the kick up as well. And um, when it comes to the fire rate on this one, it's a little bit on the higher end side. And we have rapid fire on, so you want that uh, silencer on it. But I have long barrel on it. I have extended mag 2 because you do eat through bullets pretty quickly on it. I have the CQB grip as well. And the fire mod I have on there is rapid fire. So, uh, and the reasoning and why is because. We are playing stakeout 24 seven hardcore. The main reason that uh, we need that rapid fire is so we get our bullets off faster. And the mode that we're using it in is hardcore. So you die super quick. You need to make sure that you get your bullets off as fast as you possibly can. That's why I have the rapid fire on this. Um, so that's the setup for the pistol. Let's move on over to some gameplay and I'll show you which uh, perks I used and the whole class setup to help us get through and unlock these akimbos. Okay, so this game here doesn't show me pretty much unlocking the, uh, here, I'll pause it right here, uh, uh, unlocking the akimbos. Unfortunately, I recorded the actual footage of me unlocking it in-game, and there's no volume to it. So, uh, it's pretty much you have to reach level 32, which as you can see, is I've, re I've reached level 32. That's what you need to unlock the uh, akimbos for that but um the, what i'm actually using is ninja uh tracker and cold-blooded and that'll help me to get recon so if i die it'll actually give you that glimpse of where everybody kind of is on the map i'm also playing stakeout which is a very very close quarter uh map the matches are super short even if you're playing domination only goes only goes up to 100 and it's something that where a lot of people are always next to you so it's very easy to get kills but it's also very easy to get killed so that's the trade-off with playing stakeout 24 7 hardcore but pistols are a one to two hit shot every single time so as you'll see we'll, we'll get a couple of furry kills in here we'll get double kills we'll just uh you know pretty much rack up a bunch of xp for the pistols so this is what i'm using uh i'm using stim shot which can help here and there uh i was going in between that and flash grenades so i would go between those two but that's the perks that i was using and those are pretty much the lethal and the tactical that i'm using for this setup so let's get into some gameplay so we're playing a hardcore team deathmatch um like I said, it's it's one where you can get a couple of kills, or you can get a couple of shots off, but you can get killed pretty easily. Uh, but as you can see, it kind of flashes up where people are on the map. And here, I think after we died here, I think we end up getting a Fury kill. Well, actually, maybe after this time. Yeah, after this time here, we end up getting a Fury kill here. So it's got killed three times in a row, but... Uh, the reason why I have that extended mags on as well, too, as you can see, we eat through those bullets, but... I mean that's super simple super easy it's pretty much the same thing in every call of duty but we just got a fury kill quick little double kill right there as well which is so fast i mean you're just getting kills left and right so it doesn't matter if somebody else has a shotgun whatever it may be and we you know we died three times in a row but we literally just got about seven eight kills you know just like that but uh that's what i was kind of doing on this map here was making sure i wasn't pressing super hard and going to the spots where people are spawning where people are running to, through to try to get to the other sides of the map that's where you're going to actually access and get a lot more kills that way as you can see so a lot of times people are running through there so that's a good way to, to kind of post up not camping but you're posting up 
and allowing the enemy to kind of run to you and you can just be picking people off like crazy so some of the game footage i had that was all muted because i didn't have my uh my audio on was they were spawning in this area and i was just lighting them up like i had like five kills in a row and they were just kept spawning there then they spawn in a different area so it's a little spawn trap but nothing too crazy but there can come for you right there but what's nice is you're kind of blocked but we're killing it on this game and i think this game we ended up going like 20 or 30 something um that guy i got him flying off there but uh what's cool is these maps are super super short uh, i mean the maps are uh small but the matches are super super short so you'll be running through and getting the xp and unlocking stuff pretty quickly i had on double xp because it was the weekend not any tokens i had but uh i just use it uh, that was to my advantage so you can also do this on nuketown 24 7 so if they take away stakeout for whatever reason which they have done that you can then go on to nuketown and do the exact same thing with hardcore it's a little bit more difficult but this was my setup this is what i experienced those are the perks that i use as you can see here we're getting insane point blank kills uh, sometimes you don't even have to aim with the setup as well and it just tears right through them so hopefully this video helped you guys and hopefully this helped with uh you unlocking the akimbo pistols if you have any questions down below please let me know and um I, look, we just got a triple kill well we killed one of our teammate we pretty much got a triple kill but uh let me know down in the comments uh if you have any questions and or if there's any other uh things that you need for this setup so thank you guys so much for watching make sure you guys like and subscribe if you did enjoy the video and i will see you guys on the next one take care